variables are nothing but reserved memory locations to store values this means that when we create a variable the compiler allocates a memory based on its data type there are two types of variables in scala mutable and immutable mutable variables are defined using var keyword and their values can be changed immutable variables are defined using val keyword and their values cannot be changed once assigned you can think of immutable variables as final variables in java let's do a hands on on variables log into cloudx lab and type scala to launch scala shell let's define an immutable variable x of integer data type with the value 8 type well x colon int equals 8 notice capital i in int now try changing the value of x to 9 we have got an error as discussed we cannot change the value of an immutable variable let's define a mutable variable y of integer data type with the value 7 type where y colon int equals 7 now try changing the value of y to 9 now we can see that we have successfully changed the value of y to 9 let's understand why do we need immutable variables in large systems we do not want to be in a situation where a variable's value changes unexpectedly as this may lead to unpredictable results in the cases of threads apis functions and classes we may not want some of the variables to change in these scenarios we define the variables as immutable variables in scala we can define the variables without specifying their data type The Scala compiler can understand the type of the variable based on the value assigned to it. This is called variable type inference. Let's do a hands-on on type inference. Let's define a variable x and assign it a value high, type where x equals high in double quotes in the Scala shell. As we can see, Scala has determined the type of the variable x as a string let us explicitly define the type of the variable x as a string type where space x colon string equals high we can see that variable x is a string we should always try to explicitly define the type of a variable to ensure that the code is compiled faster and to avoid any ambiguity